Hi everyone, it's Shannon Rose, and today I thought it'd be really fun to do a thrift store haul with you guys. Uh, I am a thrift store lover. I'm kind of like obsessed and addicted to thrift stores. Um, I got quite a few things in the past like month that I haven't shown you guys, and so I wanted to show you. Um, I went to thrift stores like all along, uh, let's see, a bunch of different states because we were traveling, and so uh, this is kind of accumulated from a bunch of different places in the country. Some of these things I got for Christmas gifts. Um, I found this bear, um, which is like the cutest little thing. Um, and I got him for my dad because I thought my dad would really like him. He was $25 um, at a thrift store in Palm Desert, California. All right, I found this really awesome platter. I thought it was really pretty. I don't really have a lot of like dishware or bakeware and I've been getting more into wanting to like bake and cook and film videos like that so I wanted to make them like aesthetically pleasing and I just thought this just spoke to me and it said Shannon take me with you so uh yeah I got this for $5.99 I found this oh no I'm like the kids must have spilt something on it gross um but I have to clean that now uh for $8.49 this salt lamp I love salt lamps um, and I thought that was a pretty good deal for a salt lamp, although I need to clean it now. Okay, then I found this and it needs a little bit of a cleaning, but how cool and pretty is this planter? It's like a ceramic one. I got it for $5.49 and this is a gift for my sister, um, but there's another piece to it, which is in this bag. Um, okay, how cool is this? I found this for $3.49 and it is one of those like macrame plant holders. And if you guys know my little sister, you know she's like the plant lady. <laughs> and I just thought this would look so cool. Um, so this is what that looks like. And then I thought I could get her like a fun little like plant and then gift this to because it's um it's really funny christmas day is my sister's birthday and so um every year we try to make it special for her and make sure that we get her a nice gift so that's one of her gifts and i hope she likes that this is probably one of my favorite finds i got this for eight dollars um it is a hand um mixer for like baking and i just thought that was really cool so i'm excited to uh, use that for baking because I don't have my big KitchenAid mixer because it's in storage right now um, and we're staying at my mom and Jim's house um, oh, how cool was this is that not a cool find or what this was three dollars and 49 cents and I thought that this was just so cool I love it I just like picture drinking or like using it as like a little paintbrush holder so many fun um, ideas with that. I found some really good pottery um, on the west coast coming down. Here's another one. This was handmade, by the way. This um, was also $3.49. But, like, how cool is this? Are you guys, it's like focusing on my face. Focus on this. This is way cooler. It even um, has like the engraving of whoever made it, engraving, like they put their name on it. Bridget Gonzalez. Um, so, Bridget Gonzalez, I I am treasuring your creation. Um, and then let's see, what other fun things can I show you that I got? Oh, this one was really cool. Look at this. Isn't that awesome? So I would use this for like if I'm baking to put like all my spices in and then be able to like pour it in or um i don't know be able to eat like ice cream out of what would you guys use this jar for so cool this was four dollars and 49 cents um and i really loved it i kind of like this like old style like primitive looking grandma stuff um all right fun i found so many like good oh, yeah this is a good one too check this out how cool is this little it's like all glazed pottery 
and this was $3.49. So pretty. Love that. Like, look at all of this, like, pottery stuff I found. Oh, got a whole collection. All right, what else? Oh, this was $4.49. I found these um, little, I don't really know what these are for, to be honest, but I really liked them and I figured I could use them for something. What do you use these for? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> they were too beautiful to pass up. And then I totally scored with finding this set um, because this, Can you see this? My camera's not wanting to focus on it. There we go. So this is this set. This was $7.49. Um, can you guys see? And then, so these are the little plates. And then I also, when I was shopping around at the same store, found um, this. So I think one of them must have broken because there was only three of the plates. But you can see how pretty, so that was $8.49. And then I found this bowl for $9.49. Yeah, isn't that beautiful? So I kind of have like a whole, well, not really a full set technically, but enough to make me happy. <laughs> I don't have any like nice dishes, you know? Okay, so that's everything in that box. Then we will move on. Oh, I found this little wooden, rolling pin because I want to start baking bread again. Um, I was supposed to be gluten free, but I kind of gave up on that. <laughs> I miss my bread. Um, and so yeah, I got this rolling pin. This is like 250, I think. Um, and then I found these wooden bowls, which I thought were really cool. I always see like people making these like really fancy acai bowls and stuff in their little wooden bowls and they were a dollar 99 each. So those are really cool. Always wanted some wooden bowls. Um, okay, if you know me, you know that I love my grandma clothes. This was $7.49. Um, I don't know if you guys can see. I don't know why my focus is like being weird on here. But anyway, this was $7.49. The fact that this, oh my gosh, I'm just like obsessed. <laughs> you guys might think like Shannon, that's the ugliest thing ever, but I love it. I love um, like crew neck sweaters. And with a collar built in, like, oh my gosh, yes, please, I will take it. I love it. Um, so it's from Top Stitch by Morning Sun. I don't know what that brand is, but I love it. And I think I'm going to wear this on Christmas. You'll probably see this after Christmas, but. Um, okay. Then, okay. I, <laughs> I'm like really getting into this, like, I don't know if this is like primitive. It's like. I don't really know what the like style of it is, but I really like using kind of like older style things for cooking because I think it's fun and it makes me happy. So this, um, honestly, I have no idea what it is. Can you guys, anybody knows what this is? Will you let me know in the, in the comments? Why is it not wanting to focus on the stuff I'm holding? Uh, don't focus on my face. No one cares about that. Anyway, this was $4 and I think it's like to mix or to like, uh, what is it called when you um, like ground stuff? I don't know, let me, let me know what this is. Anyways, it could be great as like a weapon and also for cooking. So I figured it's, you know, multi-functional. Um, okay, then I found these like napkins. So this set was $4. Has anybody else noticed like thrift stores and stuff, the prices have gone up significantly. I think it's just because of inflation, but I'm like, man, I miss when I could have got this stuff for like 25 cents, now it's $4. So yeah, for two napkins, $4, but I thought, oh, they're so pretty and like Christmassy and they seem like good quality, you know? So I like buying older things because I feel like they're a better quality and they last longer. They were just made better back then, you know? Um, here are some more napkins. This one says eight napkins for $4. So I guess I got a deal on that, but they have like this little embroidery on it. Um, you guys see that? That's so pretty. So I don't know. I figured, oh, I can have like these little napkins and have little, 
I don't know. I imagine myself having like a fancy dinner party one day. <laughs> it's probably never gonna happen, but a girl can dream. Um, and then I found these, which I really liked these. This was only a dollar, so wow, what a good deal I got on that. Um, all right, so let's open one up and you can kind of see. This is what they look like. I think they're really pretty. You can like get those little napkin rounds, you know? things that they go around like that and like have it put on the plate and it could look kind of fancy and cute and I guess you could do the same thing with these ones you know okay this next thing was probably one of my favorite things that I found this bowl was ten dollars and it is just like a really nice thick ceramic bowl and it's big it's like look how big it is uh, and I loved that like forest green color and so I definitely wanted to get that um, and then the last thing that I got and this was uh, pretty exciting was <laughs> this gingerbread country cabin it's from a company called the Longerberry company Longerberry Longerberger I don't know I'm totally pronouncing it wrong sorry um, I think they make these like fancy baskets but this it's so cool because every year my kids we give my or my mom always buys these gingerbread houses for the kids to like decorate but they can never eat it because it's not vegan and my husband's really strict like with food stuff so I found this like mold that I can make the kids their own gingerbread houses obviously it's a lot more work <laughs> you know like making it from scratch like mixing the dough and everything for them but this like th that way they could at least like you know if they want to like eat some of it they can so I figured well if I buy this then I can make them gingerbread houses um, every year and I don't know that's at least the, the plan um, and so this is like pottery which is really cool and then it came with this um, whole thing on how like uh, to build it and what they look like and I just thought like wow that is really cool um, so I was, yeah, excited about this little fun find. So that was everything that I found that I wanted to share with you guys. I hope you guys like this thrift store haul. Um, I'm so obsessed with thrifting that I could do this like all the time. So if you want to see more videos like this one, definitely let me know down in the comments. I hope you guys all had a wonderful holiday. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for watching. I'm sending you all my love and all my positive energy and I hope to see you in my next video. Mwah.